Welcome back to my channel Impart Math Knowledge. This video is about Theory of Equations, Geometric Progression. Check my previous video for Arithmetic Progression. Geometric Progression is a sequence where every term bears a constant ratio to its preceding term. The general form of geometric progression is a, a r, a r square, a r cube, etc. a r power, n minus 1. Common ratio is any term by preceding term that is r. For cubic equation, the roots are of the form a by r, a, a r. S1, sum of the roots taken one at a time, minus a1 by a0. S2, sum of the roots taken two at a time, a2 by a0. S3, product of the roots, minus a3 by a0. For fourth degree equation, the roots are of the form a by r, a, a r, a r square. S1, sum of the roots taken one at a time, minus a1 by a0. S2, sum of the roots taken 2 at a time, A2 by A0. S3, sum of the roots taken 3 at a time, minus A3 by A0. S4, product of the roots, A4 by A0. The problem is, solve the equation x cube minus 7x squared plus 14x minus 8 is equal to 0, whose roots are in GP. The condition given here is, the roots are of GP form. For third degree equation, the roots are a by r, a, a r. Given x cube minus 7x square plus 14x minus 8 is equal to 0. Take this as number 1. Coefficient of x cube is 1. Coefficient of x square is minus 7. Coefficient of x is 14. Constant term is minus 18. Let the roots be a by r. A, A, R. We can find the roots using the relation between roots and coefficients. Product of the roots taken 3 at a time is minus A3 by A0. A by R, A, A, R is equal to minus A3 by A0. R are getting cancelled. A3 value is minus 8. So, minus of minus 8 a0 value is 1. a cube is equal to 8. So, a value is 2. x is equal to 2 is 1 root. So, x minus 2 is a factor. Since a is the root of the given equation, x is equal to 2 is 1 root. So, x minus 2 is a factor for the given equation. Now, divide the given equation by the factor x minus 2. We will get the second degree equation. From the second degree equation, we can find two more roots. Here first term is x cube. Here x is there. So, x square into x is x cube minus x square into 2 is 2x square. Changing the sign. x cube, x cube getting cancelled. Here minus 5x square plus 14x. Here minus 5x square is there. Here x is there. So you put minus 5x in the quotient. Minus 5x into x is minus 5x square. Minus 5x into 2 is plus 10x. Now changing the sign. 5x square, 5x square getting cancer. 14 minus 10 is 4, so 4x minus 8. Here 4x is there and here x is there. Put 4 in the quotient. 4 into x is 4x. 4 into minus 2 is minus 8. Now changing the sign, sign you will get 0. x square minus 5x plus 4 is equal to 0. Factorizing this. The two possible factors are minus 1 and minus 4. If you add this, you will get minus 5. If you multiply this, you will get 4. So, this can be written as x square minus 4x minus 1x plus 4 is equal to 0. From first and the second term, take x outside. 
So x minus 4. Third and the fourth term take minus 1 outside. x minus 4 is equal to 0. So x minus 1 into x minus 4 is equal to 0. So from this we get x minus 1 is equal to 0 implies that x is equal to 1. x minus 4 is equal to 0 implies that x is equal to 4. So the roots are Two comma four comma one. Solve the equation x to the power four fifteen x cube plus seventy x square minus one twenty x plus sixty four is equal to zero. Whose roots are in geometric progression. This is a fourth degree equation, so it has four roots. For geometric progression, the roots are of the form a by r a a r and a r square given x to the power 4 minus 15 x cube plus 70 x square minus 120 x plus 64 is equal to 0 here a naught is equal to 1 a 1 is equal to minus 15 a 2 70 a 3 minus 120 a 4 is 64 assume that the roots are A by R, A, A R, A R square. Find A and R value using the relation between coefficients, sum of the roots taken two at a time and product of the roots. A by R, A, A by R, A R, A by R, A R square plus a into a r then a into a r square then a r into a r square this is equal to a2 by a naught r r getting cancelled here one r getting cancelled a square is common for all the terms so we can write this as a square 1 by r plus 1 plus r plus r plus r square plus r cube. A2 value is 70. A naught is 1. So 70. So this can be written as a square 1 by r plus 1 plus 2r plus r square plus r cube is equal to 70. Take this as number 2. Product of the roots a4 by a0. a by r a a r a r square is equal to a4 by a0. r r getting cancelled. So a to the power 4 r square a4 value is 64. A naught value is 1. Taking square root on both sides, we will get A square R is equal to 8. So, A square is equal to 8 by R. Substitute A square value in equation 2, we will get R value. Now operate 8 by r inside. 8 by r square. 8 by r. 16 r by r. 8 r square by r. 8 r cube by r is equal to 70. Taking LCM we get 8 plus 8 r plus 16 r square plus 8 r cube plus 8 r to the power 4 by r square is equal to 70. Now this can be written as 8 r to the power 4 plus 8 r cube plus 16 r square minus 70 r square plus 8 r plus 8 is equal to 0. Now this can be written as 8 r to the power 4 plus 8 r cube minus 54 r square plus 8 r plus 8 is equal to 0. Dividing throughout by 2 we will get 4 r to the power 4 plus 4 r cube 
minus 27 r square plus 4 r plus 4 is equal to 0. If you put r is equal to 1, the equation is not satisfied. Then you try with the next value. For r is equal to 2, the equation is satisfied. If not, you can try with the next value. r is equal to 2 is 1 root for the equation 4. Now substitute r is equal to 2 in equation 3. Equation 3 is a square is equal to 8 by r. Substitute r is equal to 2 in equation 3. That is a square is equal to 8 by r. So a square is equal to 8 by 2. That is 4. A square is equal to 4. So a value is plus or minus 2. We neglect the negative value. We consider the positive value. A is equal to 2. So A is equal to 2. And R is equal to 2. The roots are. A by R. A. A R. A R square. So A is 2. 2 by 2. 2. 2 into 2. 2 into 2 square. So the value is 1, 2, 4, 8. So the roots for the given equation is 1, 2, 4, 8. Next one, find the condition that the roots of the equation x cube minus px square plus qx minus r is equal to 0 may be in geometric progression. Given equation is x cube minus px square plus qx minus r is equal to 0. Take this as number 1. As usual, we write a naught is 1, a1 is minus p, and a2 is q, and a3 is minus r. For geometric progression, the roots are of the form a by r, a, a r. We know that product of the roots taken 3 at a time is minus a3 by a naught, that is a by r, a, A, R is equal to A3 value is minus R. So, minus of minus R and A naught value is 1. one. R are getting cancelled. So, A cube is equal to R. Since A is a root of the given equation, so we put X is equal to A in equation 1. Replace A cube by R. R minus P A square plus Q A minus r is equal to 0. r are getting cancelled. So, we will get a square p plus a q is equal to 0. a is common, take it outside. So, if you take minus a outside, we will get a p minus q is equal to 0. The required condition is a p minus q is equal to 0. For finding the roots for the given equation, first you write the roots. Then from the product of the roots, you will get a q value. Since a is a root of the equation, you replace x by a in the given equation. Simplifying this, we will get the required condition. Practice these third degree and fourth degree problem in the same manner. If you have any doubt, please comment in the comment box. Hope you all understand. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please subscribe and share.